Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, just a quick heads up that if you are using Microsoft and Windows themes, one of which I have displayed on my desktop, then just to let you know that if you are using the Windows themes web page, not the Microsoft Store, the actual website, that Microsoft is going to retire the page soon. And that's where you can obviously access the different system themes for Windows 10 and Windows 11 from the Windows themes download page, which is this uh, website. And just to let you know that Microsoft has said that in this announcement, this page containing links to download Windows themes is now obsolete and will be retired soon. Now, they don't give us an exact date and time. They just say soon in true Microsoft fashion. But um, they also say they recommend downloading the latest themes directly from the Microsoft Store for the best experience. So they're giving you a link here. So if you click on this, obviously that will redirect you to the Microsoft Store where you can get your hands on the different themes. And how you would do this is you would just click on one of those and click on Get, and that would download and install the theme onto your system. Now, even though when the page becomes obsolete, you can download your themes from the Microsoft Store, it seems that doing it through this actual web page is a lot easier because they've broken it down into a nice kind of format here. So it's a lot easier to navigate and to check out. And there are 13 categories in total. And as an example, you would just click on one of those categories and yeah, you've got all the themes under that category, which I think is a nice move. And then what you would do, and if you still want to get your hands on a lot of these themes, because as mentioned, yeah, they've got the category and everything pertaining to that animals category, as an example, is under that section. So it's a lot easier to get it downloaded from here. So you would just click on one of those and then you would save it to your download location and then you would head into your download location and what you would do is you would just double click on that and it will apply it on Windows 10 and Windows 11 it will apply it if you head to your personalization page it will apply it onto this page and you can see I've got a couple of extra themes I have on both my Windows devices, which I use on a regular basis. So I'm just putting it out there that uh, just in case you were using this website, it's going to be no longer soon. And then you'll have to get your um, themes from the Microsoft Store. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.